become a source of tension in some neighborhoods with debates about where and when to play. KTV's Ali Rasmus is in San Francisco where the dispute over one pickleball court went viral because of an online petition. Ali? Yeah, we are at the Presidio, and behind us is the Presidio Wall Playground Pickleball Courts. They've been open since 7 o'clock this morning, and they're pretty full. It's been a hub of activity here since it opened. You can see and hear this activity. In fact, the noise is what some people who live nearby are upset about. The noise is awful. It's just nerve-breaking. It just echo all over, bang, bang, bang to your head. Now it is a more distinct and staccato noise than what tennis balls and rackets makes. The San Francisco Chronicle recently reported that a woman who lives nearby this court in the Presidio, who also happens to be the wife of a tech executive and investor, recently circulated an online petition calling on the city to shut down this pickleball court until the city can do an environmental review. She claims that in the petition that the noise is affecting home values, the environment and residents' way of life. But she's also getting a lot of backlash online and on social media after it was discovered that she has her own pickleball court in the backyard of her $36 million mansion. Pickleballers in the community say it was hypocritical of her to try and shut down these public courts while keeping her own. People who live nearby and are outside of this fray wonder why everyone involved can't find a compromise. Look at how many people are out there playing. I mean, that's amazing. I can understand the noise factor. That's legitimate. But let's just try to work on innovation. We're so good at that here, right? Her suggestion, do something to muffle the sound of the pickleball paddles. Now, there's supposedly certain types of balls and paddle covers that can be used to reduce that pocking noise. Uh, but then you get into the question of whether that kind of regulation can even be enforced when you have crowds like this at uh, pickleball courts. Now, at last check, the change.org petition that the neighbor had circulated was taken down, but the debate about this continues. We have reached out to San Francisco's Rec and Park District to get more information from them and hear their response to this dispute. Live in San Francisco, Ali Rasmus, KTVU, Fox News. Ali, thank you. There's another pickleball court controversy down in the South Bay. A